Now, the Reba State Command of the Niger Security and Civil Defense Corps has a new state commandant, Michael Besson Oga, following the promotion of the former commandant, Abu Tambuo, who has been promoted to the rank of Assistant Commandant General. Uh, this is part of efforts to tackle illegal oil bunkering with a view to prioritizing the protection of critical national assets and infrastructure from attacks or vandalism. Details in this report. The new state commandant, Michael Oga, while addressing the senior management staff officers, divisional officers, and others on his first day in office, pointed out that there is much to do in the fight against illegal oil bunkering and illegal dealings in the petroleum industry in River State. He noted that since intelligence is the bedrock of security, the public must partner with the Corps by providing credible intelligence and information that would assist the command to nip in the bud all activities leading to environmental degradation and economic sabotage across the region. We to rearrange the security architecture of Nigerian Security Defense Corps in River State. Within a month or two, you are going to see a big difference. We are not going to do business as usual. There's a new sheriff in town. Please inform them that this place cannot accommodate them again. We are going to smoke them out wherever they are doing their bunker activities. We will never compromise. If you go to the creek, many of the aquatic life have been destroyed. Here in Port Harcourt, even, you, you know you have a thick fog, black smoke covering River State. It's because of this illegal bunkery. So I'm here to fight bunkery. I'm here to stop bunkery. We are not going to stop at the bunkers alone. We are going to extend it to the sponsors. Whoever they are in the society, we are going to deal with them accordingly. Commandant Oga, however, gave a stern warning against the violation of fundamental human rights of the citizens by the officers. He said the security agency has the statutory mandate to exhibit a high level of professionalism and respect for the dignity of persons, as his administration would not tolerate any iota of brutality against civilians. We are not supposed to brutalize anybody. And as a the charge is unacceptable to me. Any attempt to kill anybody claiming that it's a center the charge, I disagree. So they should know how to handle their weapons and also to, how to deal with the public. But I will not tolerate any indiscipline as I'm here. And it should be always punctual to that duty. So I want my colleague, the general colleague here in this command, to sit up and work with me so that we can move the country forward, so that we can move the state forward. He further maintained that there is a need for collaboration among security agencies and all stakeholders in order to combat the menace of insecurity in the nation. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.